All right, let's just get it out of the way real fast. This mod may not install for everyone, especially on people on Android 9.0. Some people on Android 8.0 might not either. Also, people that don't have an Adreno GPU device. I'm sorry, all I have is Adreno. I don't have any Mali. I don't have any PowerVR or whatever other GPUs exist for Android. Anyway, so I'm just going to... Let me jump over past this introduction part. All right, skip the intro. I'm a, I'm 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 doing a demonstration because some people like me doing a full on de demonstration from start to finish instead of just starting up an account and all that stuff. So anyway, first thing right off the bat that uh, you're gonna be able to tell easily is besides the currency, which is like on every mod APK that's available for MKX, is uh this might also be available too because I think that's I think someone else started doing it too. But if you go to your equipment, you have all your equipment unlocked from the get go. All right, and they're all maxed out, so that's just how that is. Ne uh, next thing is uh, if you go to the store, which I'm gonna need to do anyway, uh, you have extra card packs in here, so yada, right? And I need to get a level up card so I can show y'all something. So let me just open up this one right quick. All right, so I don't know if I said it, but the thing with card packs is uh, the things with the prices on them still can't buy those. Sorry, but. Whatever. I mean, they're not really important because they're just character cards. You can get those characters inside of here because, again, like every other mod APK out there, you got extra characters in here. So, yada. Anyway, not all the characters, such as, you know, one of the scorpions is missing. That's all I know. I forgot which one. Well, one of them is missing. Uh, but, yeah. So, and support cards, pretty sure these are all normally in here except for the experience card. These three normally aren't, but you can get them if you want, you know, just buy that, add it to collection, you gotta get some more experience from your fights, etc. Uh, next one is Feats of Strength, which I think I gotta do the tutorial for it, because, oh no, I did, I already did it, alright, cool. I'm, uh, I'm gonna go get Shao Kahn right quick. So, to get Shao Kahn, really easy, just do a Relic Hunt, uh, start this up, and uh, go to Shao Kahn, alright, go to Resurrect. All right, and then if you can, skip the FMV. If you can't, let it play through. All right, so there we go. Con added. Again, if you want to, uh, no thanks. If you want to unlock them again, just hit just hit Resurrect. Skip the FMV. You're going to get a second one. It's going to fuse it. You know how the deal is. Do that a couple times, you'll get to X. Okay, so that's that. I'm just going to do it one, uh, one more time just because why not, right? Just to show you all that it can be repeated. It's not a one-time thing. All right, cool. Get out of there. Right, get out of Relic Hunt. Go back to the main menu. All right. Uh, Reptile is also here. You can also summon him if you want to. I'm not going to fight him because, yeah, I'm not set up for that right now. But you can if you really want to go that route. So with uh, Feats of Strength, I'm going to go to Shao Kahn because I just got him. But as you can see right now, I can do all of these. I'll go to these last ones. Flip these over, preview them if I want, and uh, equip it. So that's a green thing on them. All right, victory stance. If I want to pop this, equip that, taunt, same deal. Put that on there. Uh, icons. Um, let me see. Uh, equip this one that changes there. Uh, this is the background. I don't like that one. Nah, this one's cool. Equip that, changes that. Go to titles. Put emperor on my shit. <laughs> so emperor is put up there. Emperor craze on TCG. Okay, and uh, that's pretty much it. You can go to Rune Offerings if you want, but there's like no reason. Uh, these things are only quote unquote unlocked with this mod. So if you go back to the normal version, they're going to stay on there as long as you still have access to your account. But you're not going to be able to put any new ones on because technically you don't have them unlocked. They're just visually available with the mod. All right, let me just go show you real quick that those green things are on Shadow Cons. Let me just go win a fight real quick. Let me just go to battle mode. All right, but first off, let me level this dude up real quick. So I have five level up cards, but they're infinite. So if I just, you know, do this a couple times, you're going to see I'm going to hit level five, but I still got cards to go. So I can just keep on doing it. All right, level 16. I think that's good enough. Let me get out of here. Claim that. Get out of this. Uh, go back to edit team. And uh, let me just start up this fight. All right, let me just start this one up. All right, finish that fight. Cool. And then you're going to see the victory pose plus those those emblem, those green things around them, whatever they're called. Uh, but, yeah, there you go. That's how that's done. 
Okay, so just to show that it does show up is on your character, yada. If if you do uh, faction wars, it's gonna show up when when other people lose to your uh, your AI controlled set. And the last final thing for this mod is talent tree. So you can do a full on talent tree. You ain't gotta just do one 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 one. All right. So I might have zero, but because of the infinite currency mod, technically I don't need that. So if I pop into this one, you're gonna see it's just gonna upgrade off the bat. Alright, if I back out and I jump into this one, it's going to upgrade right off the bat and I can do this one as well. Alright, same thing with this one, yada, 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 yada. Alright, and now those three are done, I can jump to the next one if I want. I don't even got to highlight it, you know, and whatever. I could go to this one too if I really wanted to, just do three of them in advance, you know. And I can go to this one, because I haven't done this one yet, you know. Etc. And I can unlock this if I want. Unlock, unlock, unlock. Alright, so there you go. And uh, now you can see it's a full on tree. Alright, five is the max. And doing any more doesn't give you any more power, so don't even think about that. It does glitch up your whole visual though. <laughs> so, like, these are all mastered and they're all five. But if I tap on one again, it's gonna go to six and seven. And eight nine ten it doesn't do anything the more you give it it doesn't do anything extra so it just gives you gives a, a a graphical visual glitch okay such so as this and then this is it's the same mastered it's white now all right so yada and again it, it works on all of them it's, it's not just the first one and whatever all right so there you go with that that's how you do that all right pretty simple anyway yeah, so that's pretty much that. Thanks for checking this out. You guys use this mod, have fun with it. You will most likely get banned, but that's just how it is. If you go and cheat, look forward to the ban. Don't be afraid of it. All right, then. Bye-bye. Peace out. Later. Adios. Oh, and also, I may not update this when the next one comes out. As you can see, I put this one out stupid late. Like, the next update should be out within, like, a week. You know what I'm saying? Or within, like, a week or two. But I... You know, I do things on my own time. I ain't trying to get on other people's time. You know what I'm saying? So that's that's basically how it is. I may or may not up this. If, if I do, I do. If I don't, you know, whatever. It is what it is.